You have been grinding for the past months. And in the beginning, everything seemed fun. Every bit of progress felt good. Your work felt purposeful. You could think about nothing else than that work, even when you were trying to sleep. But now you feel depressed. You feel down. You can't seem to focus on that work anymore. And even though you're making progress, it just doesn't feel the same. It's like you're almost thinking about switching life paths. Frankly, I was in the same situation not too long ago. Let me take you back to the beginning of August. It is prime summer. The sun is shining, the weather is beautiful, it is warm outside, and I'm sitting in the office which I share with two other friends. Only one friend is there and he also does YouTube. We are in this office to work, but we cannot work. Our mind is filled with thoughts and doubts. And we just don't feel that spark anymore that we felt when we just started. We are talking about why the path that we had chosen isn't working yet. Maybe we just need to switch up our content style. Maybe we need to upload less. Maybe we need to upload more. Maybe we need to focus on giving more value. All these maybes. We are trying to solve the problem why we're feeling less motivated. Why we're feeling not as purposeful. Why our ideas do not come as fluidly as before. And why we don't feel the spark that we used to feel. And about a week or so later we knew why. It wasn't about those reasons that I told you before. We are sitting in front of our laptop in a coaching group call when the coach says you are in this monk mode for too long. You have been grinding for too long. The point of monk mode is to work really hard for a certain amount of time, maybe one or two months, and after that go to another mode, fun mode, for about a month or so. If you are in this monk mode, in this grind mode for too long, your results will start to deteriorate. Your feeling of purposeful work will start to diminish your work will become repetitive, boring. No ideas will come, or barely. And thus the work that you do is not monk mode anymore. It is mediocre work, mediocre mode. And it hit us. Online you hear everyone talking about monk mode, about grind mode, or however they call it. This, this mode when you're working really hard, when you're on this grind and no one can stop you, you're not giving in to distractions, but you hear no one talking about fun mode. Which is essential if you want to go on a monk mode, if you want to go on a grind season. In the beginning of October, in about one week, I'm going on a road trip with the friend of mine that also does YouTube. We're finally off the monk mode. And even though we're not there yet, we're not where we want to be yet, even though I can't buy my dad a car or help the world enough, you still need to balance it out. No hard work can exist without fun mode, without relaxation. Otherwise, hard work wouldn't be called hard work, right? To sum up, you need to get out of it. Now, even though you are not yet there, even though you are not yet where you want to be in life, it is necessary if you want to grow. Look, overworking is a real thing, and I never thought that I would say this, right? Back in the day, I always used to think that overworking was just something that weak people would say. But it is in fact true, especially if you're working really hard, especially if you're deep working for an extended amount of time. Take a break. Let's make the world a better place. And I'll see you.